Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, I'm Jalissa. So, I don't know if you guys can tell, but I got a new camera. I'm so not used to this new camera because the viewfinder is on the side now. And before, in my other camera, the G7X, the Canon G7X, the viewfinder was on top. So, I would just look at the viewfinder for like the whole video. I want to look at the viewfinder so bad. I'm like so used to looking up there at the viewfinder if you guys are wondering where i got these earrings from happiness boutique actually sent them to me so thank you so much for sending me these earrings they also sent me this like really cute necklace it looks so adorable they have like the cutest little jewelry that is just so sophisticated it looks sophisticated it looks simple and it's not like too much and they also gave me these big hoops i love hoop earrings as you guys can see super cute so i'll link them down below if you guys want to check them out but yeah, these are like so cute. These are cheetah and I love them. And I think they look really cool with my shirt. Okay, so let's get right into the video and why most of you clicked on this video. Today, I am testing out the new Callista Style Dryer. So I am so excited to try this out. Guys, when I saw that Callista came out with a blow dryer like this, like this, like the Revlon one, or the Hot Tools, or you know, just a blow dryer, like that with that style with the brush attached to the blow dryer i got so excited when i saw that they came out with this because you guys know when a blow dryer like this comes out i need to try it i need to try it on my channel if you guys are not following me on instagram go follow me because i really post a lot of stuff on instagram that i don't post on here on youtube so go ahead and check me out by the way i bought this with my money Callista did not send this to me and they did not sponsor this video this retails for about 80 dollars like 79 i believe um i think right now they have like a coupon code so you can save like 10 dollars um, so check out their website if you are interested in purchasing this. This comes with a small brush. So all of these, because they have three different sizes, that's another thing which is like crazy. They have a short one for short hair. They have a medium one for medium length hair. And they have the long one. So I got the one for the long hair because I like the big brushes. You guys already know. Um, so this is the tiny brush that comes with it. I guess you can attach it. I probably won't use this if you want me to be honest. I mean, I can kind of do a small demo for this video. But this one, I'm excited about. Whoa, okay, so this brush is bigger than I thought. Whoa, okay. So this is the Revlon. Just to show you guys kind of like a side-by-side, -side, like the size. This is the Revlon. This is the Callista. So you guys can see. It's pretty big i think they're like about the same size but for some reason this one feels bigger so this also has off cool low and high and it looks like the revlon it looks like the revlon it's a little bit bigger whoa it's like way bigger so i'm gonna part my hair to two sections i'm gonna add a little bit of the spray that i always use the prep rally from dry bar i love this after I do this section, I'm going to time it and see how long it's going to take me to do all my hair. So let's do this. This smells a little bit bad, like if it's burning. yeah this is really nice like do you guys see how sleek my hair looks and that's only with the blowout my hair looks so shiny and it's so soft right now so, yeah it's a little bit like shaky but it's actually really good i really like this brush this is really good this is really good and i can picture myself using this again so far i like it um i know i've only done this little bit but let's do a small section with this one so i'm going to take a small section from the front just so you guys can see it better okay 
okay so it does an okay job it's not bad um it's really good for the roots like really getting in there especially like in here so i would just use this maybe for like the roots as you can see i didn't even finish it back here because i just wanted to focus a little bit more on the roots and so this is really good for the roots i really like this for the roots i might even use this for just the roots i'm gonna do my hair and i'll be right back with the final look so i'm going to start the timer right now and let's do this Alright guys, so here's the final look. What do you guys think? Um, I think it actually looks really good. I think it looks very shiny and very healthy. Like it is so soft, so smooth. So it took me about 39 minutes to do my hair. Add maybe like 2 or 3 minutes because I did do a section or 2 before timing it. So to me that's not bad but it definitely is a lot longer than what it usually takes me to blow out my hair with my revlon and with my hot tools so with those tools it takes me about 30 minutes to blow my hair i did feel like this took a little bit longer to get my hair dry like i don't i don't think it has anything to do with the brush because the brush is very big and it was doing a great job it's just you really have to do a couple of passes and it takes a little bit longer i think it's just the blow dryer itself i don't know i feel like this doesn't dry my hair as much as I wanted to dry my hair. But overall, I really do like how my hair looks. Again, I just feel like maybe up here I would have to go in with my straightener because up here, like in this section right here, that's super wavy. And sometimes when with a blowout, it's just not enough. Um, but as you can see, this side does look very sleek. So I have some pros and cons. So pros, I really like the size of the brush. And I like how big it is and you can still really get in the roots at least I can because my hair is a little bit longer, but I can still really get in the roots with this big brush and I'm able to really grab my hair very well. I also like the price. I think $80, well, $70 if you use like that coupon code that they have online. Um, I think that's not bad. I like how you can get different sizes of this blow dryer. So if you have shorter hair, you can get the medium. If you have even shorter hair, you can get the small, the short or whatever. Um, but yeah, that's really cool that they have that option. Another pro is that I really like how my hair turned out. I know it took me a little bit longer, but I really like how my hair turned out. Like, I barely need a flat iron right now. Like, maybe like up here, like I said, just a little bit. But overall, it's pretty straight and it looks very shiny, very healthy. I like how my hair turned out. So I do have some cons. So the first thing that I didn't like is that up here, it gets really hot. With the Revlon and other tools, I really like how this is like big up here so i don't know but it doesn't really get hot up here um so you can really like move around and you won't have to worry about touching up here because it doesn't get hot down here it kind of like stops your hands from getting a little bit higher if you know what i mean this one it's just like straight all the way um so sometimes if you go a little bit up you do feel 
the burn not like a burn but you do feel the heat so i don't really like that about this tool so you just got to keep in mind that you have to keep your arms a little bit lower but at the same time you have to be careful not to move around the heat setting something else that i didn't love is i mean i know it brings another attachment and that's cool and everything i don't really need it so it's not like something that i really wanted but i just feel like this is not secure do you guys hear that like it doesn't feel secure you see that do you guys know what i mean it doesn't feel secure especially when you're like pulling your hair it just feels like this is gonna fall off so kind of don't like that it is locked but it feels like it's gonna fall off if you know what i mean so that i didn't really like i didn't like how it was just moving around a little bit and it just didn't feel sturdy so that's a con another con is that it took me longer to blow out my hair you guys know i like doing things fast very very fast so i mean those extra 15 minutes i don't like that if i can blow out my hair in 30 minutes i'd rather do that as compared to 45 but yeah i don't love how it took me way longer to blow out my hair and i really had to do a couple of passes like it wasn't getting dry that quickly so yeah would i recommend this yes i would if you don't have a blow dryer like this and if you want a blow dryer like the revlon that is a little bit smaller i would totally recommend maybe getting the medium um size of this for example if you have short hair as compared to maybe the dry bar which is 150 and is you know it's like double the price it's like a lot of money if you have longer hair this is still good you get really good results i really do like how my hair looks just to know that it's gonna take you maybe like a couple more minutes to do your hair i mean as a first impression i did like it maybe this is better for heat damage though like maybe the technology in this blow dryer is way better than the revlon for example or the hot tools or other tools that are like this one so if it is better for your hair and if it's better for the long run then yeah i would just use this one instead because i also don't want to damage my hair you know what i mean so if this doesn't damage my hair over time then i just rather use this one for sure even if i have to spend the extra 15 minutes blowing out my hair it's gonna be totally worth it at the end okay guys let me know if you like this video if you did make sure you give it a big thumbs up also let me know in the comments down below if you liked this hair tool and if you want me to compare it to another hair tool like maybe the revlon or maybe the hot tools which is the exact same price so that would be a really cool comparison like a side by side um comparison so let me know in the comments down below if that's something that you guys are interested in watching also don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel and turn on your post notifications so you can get notified every time i upload a video bye guys love you